For the Treehouse Foundation, we believe in community and belonging and the generosity of lifting one another up. The Treehouse Foundation is an intergenerational community for families who are adopting children from the public foster care system and who live next door to older adults who share their time, their talents, their resources. This year, we're celebrating our 15th anniversary of Life on Treehouse Circle. We're very excited to be celebrating 15 years of fabulous intergenerational relationship building. The intergenerational community works in so many ways. It's really important for kids to be connected with people who are older. Kids like mine, he doesn't have grandparents. He doesn't have that connection to the older generation. And he does now, he has it here. Treehouse is so different from just living in a house. It's a home, friends instead of just neighbors. They're here, they're here for me. They've stepped up like family. They've stepped up like community. All right. The combination of elders with kids and parents is amazing. My name is Mari Gomez. I'm a Treehouse community member. I'm a Treehouse board member. You can ask any of my kids, like, what do you think about your house? They, they go like, right away, I love it. I love my elders. I love my neighbors. I love what we do after school. I love uh, our trees. Um, I love the, the view. I love the way we can just walk around the community and we feel safe. Because I have kids with special needs. So for them, it's difficult to go out in the world and they can do that in tree house they know they have support, a support family. When we had to pivot when COVID hit, we knew immediately that we couldn't have in-person fundraisers. We began innovating around fundraising. Welcome to Stir Up Some Love. It's a series of restaurant cooking demonstrations to help showcase some of the local restaurants and the recipes that have helped to make this community a special place. I'm gonna teach you guys the secret to my famous sticky ribs. I am gonna show you how to decorate a cake at your own house. Today we're gonna to be cooking some salsa verde. This is creamed corn with local hake. Today we're gonna to make a ramp pancake stuffed with Jonah crab. Today we're gonna to be preparing a pork mofongo. Stir Up Some Love brings dollars to chefs and restaurants that are really in need of support. It brings much needed dollars to the Treehouse Foundation as well. And we decided that we would partner to do a fundraising campaign. Food is a universal language. Food connects every single human being and then to be able to share that with the world is something that I think more people should take on. I think that there's no better way to strengthen a community than by sharing food. It's the greater good of the community, and it's something that I'm proud to be able to give back to the community. I, of course, love to volunteer my time, and when the Treehouse Foundation approached me, then I was like, yes, that's right up my alley. I, I, I'd love to do that, and it was a lot of fun. When I was informed that it was split 50-50, the stir up some love check couldn't have come at a better time. I was thinking that that wasn't necessary, but then the months later, I was like, thank you. Working with Stir Up Some Love, so it's just an honor to be involved in it. For Stir Up Some Love to be thinking about the restaurants was, uh, was just a godsend. I'm very connected to Stir Up Some Love because I did experience being homeless, not having any food. Um, and I think the um, idea of food and taking care of children is so important. We are in our greenhouse, my beautiful world. Why should people support the Treehouse Foundation? Well, it's the future of this society. I mean, it's the future of this world is to take care of children. I mean, they are our future. You raise, basically it's like these babies here. You raise them with care, love, and give them the basic necessities, which is food and shelter and a sense of family you're gonna end up with a better society. If I had to describe the valley, 
I would say community. A treehouse is one of the most special communities here. A treehouse holds a special place in my heart. My mother and my adopted brother both live there, so they're doing a really good job, and I think we need to support them. My son is Andrew Brow, and he owns Highbrow Restaurant in Northampton, Mass. I watched him step up. I watched him reach out to the fire department, the police department delivering food and lunches. And if that's not community, you know, I don't know what is. What gives you hope? My kids. My kids give me hope. All of them. I feel they need more people who care about him, about them. Um, yeah. Kids need more people who care about them. Just one person they can trust, you can change that change the kid's life forever. So my kids give me hope. There's a real ask here, and the ask is that you support the Treehouse Foundation. It is a wonderful foundation. It is built on the understanding and importance of community. And in so doing, support your local restaurants, support the Valley, and understand how the Treehouse Foundation and restaurants and community work together. Treehouse is an amazing, amazing group of people. And what I see there is what children need. They need love, support, family, a sense of home, um, and healthy food.